Hey there, my Sagittarius friends. How are you? This is Lori of your Empress Energy. I hope that you are all doing well. I am here to do a three-month tarot leaf card. Um, tea leaf. <laughs> I'm sorry. Tea leaf card tarot reading for you. I have pre-shuffled um, this deck of cards. However, I'm going to go ahead and just give it a quick once over for your sake. I hope that all of you are doing well, and I, if you are a returning viewer, I'd like to say thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome back. If you are a new viewer, I would like to invite you to, I hope you find something that resonates with you and that you decide to come back in the future. Welcome, welcome. Okay, now I'm not confused anymore. I would uh, also, what I'm going to do here, okay, is... Take five cards from each stack. So this stack would be for the first two weeks of May. Um, if it works out that way, okay. If it doesn't, it just is what it is. And then I'll take five cards from that stack, and hopefully that'll be the second half of the month. Now, sometimes it's the whole month. It just blends together. Basket, recognition, reward for merit. Okay, and we've got three more cards here. we got doing something risky, taking a chance. Um, a change for the better and getting together with friends. So we can take one more card here. There we go. Whoops, we got two. So you may be involved with a dark man or a dark complex complexion man or a dark haired man, but you will have victory in some sort of endeavor. Okay, so this looks really, really good. Recognition for something that you have done. Okay. Great energy to start the month off with, my Sagittarius friends. You're going to encounter a change for the better, and that may come right after getting together with some friends. You may be meeting a dark man or dark complexion man that is going to bring in some sort of victory for you, okay? This is an awesome start to um, the beginning of my May. Okay, this is beautiful energy. Ah, this is the best reading I've had so far. I mean, they were good, and then they kind of went in, and then they kind of went bad. <laughs> so you guys are starting off awesome here. I'm glad to see it. Can we go ahead and finish off the month of May for the Sagittarius Collective, please? What message can we get for the second half of May? for the Sagittarius Collective, please. That looks like we got them all here. Okay. Romance is in the air. Temptation will test you. Woohoo! Oh, let's see. Oh, no. Compliments from an admirer. Okay, so love is in the air, but it does look like there is going to be you're you're feeling like someone is working against you, okay? And like you're and I think it's an X. I'm I'm strongly getting that this is an X who sees you romance in the air. Um and they you feel like they're working against you. And maybe it's really just um a sense of sorrow, okay? Um, let me see if I can pull something out. You know what? No, we're going to move on. We're going to go to June, and we'll see how this, uh, the beginning of the month starts, because maybe that will tell us more about what's going on here at the end of the month of May, okay? <laughs> Do not take risks. Be careful. Seek out information that will help you. I want to see what this says. Torch. Spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. It didn't really come out, but I am going to include that because I feel a strong, strong sense for some of you Sagittarians. Okay, we have pig. Beware of greed. An, emotion, an emotionally secure, loving family is important to you. 
Things will not always be this way. A change is coming, okay? And what I'm hearing is that this whole thing here, this whole thing that's happening here, um, this is the card that should not have come out, I'm being told. This was the card that was supposed to come out. <sighs> However, okay. So basically, I think some of the issues um, that are happening here, the loss is not over a person, it is over money, okay? It is over money. And it sounds to me like somebody was investing and some of you, someone saw gains from their investment. And instead of playing it safe, took a risk, might take a risk. You can stop this from happening, okay? You, if, if you, you are forewarned right now, so that means you're forearmed, okay? So, do not take risks. Do not get greedy, okay? And seek out the information that will help you make a wise decision in that area, okay? And if you continue down the path you're on, Things will change for the better eventually, okay? E even though you took a loss, you, it, things will improve. But what you really want is a happy home, okay? And that's your priority. So I am I think what I'm hearing is uh, you may, your intuition may speak up and tell you at the right moment, no, 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 don't do this. Don't do, don't take that risk, Okay. It sounds too good to be true because it is too good to be true. All right. Okay. So let's see what else we can get. So see, that's not so bad. I mean, that really isn't so bad. Pineapple. Reconciliation. Yep. Yep. Money will be coming to you in excitement. Okay. So we have reconciliation. I do believe that that happens here. I do believe that there, there, there is going to be an issue with a family member. That's going to cause you some stress. Okay. And uh, I think you're worried about your money. Okay. I think you, you, you and your family are worried about your money. But you, you got reconciliation and there's excitement because where things didn't turn out the way you hoped, if you didn't take the risk, now it pays off. Does that make sense? Okay. Let's see what else we can get here. I think we need at least one more card. We're going to get two. Oh, we're going to get three, though. All right, so grapes. Time to go out and have fun. Yeah, if money's coming to you and the tension's relieved, that's awesome. And you are protected from no negative forces beyond your control, okay? And increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. So I'm hearing don't play the market. Um, Work harder. Okay, work harder, increase your efforts. And it, it, it doesn't mean work hard. It means focus more on work. Okay, focus more on work rather than investments. Okay, so we're going to go back to this deck. And we'll see what we got going for July. A door or opportunities are waiting for you. That's a great way to start the month. And that's the beetle that says good fortune is coming your way romance celebrations or parties yeah okay this is good 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 news here okay so we got the five for the beginning of the month and we've got chair filled someone new is entering your life and then you have the staff which says you will be taken care of in difficult times so i am hearing you have got some major opportunities coming your way okay um You've got good fortune coming in the form of romance, celebrations, or parties, okay? If a beetle, I don't know where this is coming from. Somebody's telling me, if a beetle enters your home, consider that a sign, okay? That means your good fortune is, is there. It's around you or you're going to hear about it pretty quick, okay? Or somebody new may be sitting at your dining room table or out on the patio with you 
um, that's another sign that good fortune is entering your life. The staff here, you will be taken care of in difficult times. I'm not sure what that means yet, so let's go ahead and draw some more cards here. I mean, I know what it means, but I don't know what it means in sense to this. It means that you're on the right path re regarding some aspect of your life, okay? And I'm going to say it's financial. You've put the money aside, so your, your retirement is secure, okay? That's what I'm hearing. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, you are being warned of a problem either now or in the near future. So you're being cautioned about something. Something that could be a problem does not mean a major event. Hmm, someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change. So that's the upcoming problem. That's your upcoming challenge that you're going to have to face. Someone is working behind your back, okay? All right, so you've got the stubborn um, person who's unwilling to change. Can we get a clue as to who that might be? Nope, we got two more cards. Well, three more cards. Okay, all shuffled out. Nope, we have four more cards. Changes in your life, a two-faced friend. So you got the rat and the cat. So this is a very touch-and-go relationship. And the person, one of you, and I'm saying, I'm going to say it's the other person, is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change. And this has been like a cat and mouse game the whole time you've known each other. Okay? You've kind of known that this person is two-faced. And you know that, 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 yeah, you know, and you know, Sagittarians, who this person is, okay? Changes in your life, okay? And then you've got the harp, which brings great happiness and pleasure with close friends. So I'm saying the pleasure with your close friends. Look at this. We've got rat, cat, and dog in here, okay? That, that has to mean something, okay? So keep that in mind. Your friends will help you to uh, regain your happiness in life. Just keep whoever this rat cat and mouse person is um you need need to change that situation okay you need to uh put an end to that cat and mouse stuff and if it's a child and you can't distance yourself from this you know your child you can't they're going to be in your life forever you're going to have to um make them listen to the music is what i'm hearing okay i'm pointing at this harp you're going to have to increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals with them, okay? All right, my Sagittarian friends, if this resonated with you at all, drop me a comment and give the video a like. And of course, I would invite you to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. And if you have, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate each and every one of you. You guys have a great, take care until our energies cross again. I'm wishing you much peace, love, and happiness. Bye-bye.